Hey, 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 it is the end of day seven, week one. What? Only 11 more weeks to go. <laughs> um, no, all jokes aside though, I am extremely proud of myself. Um, I feel good today. I got out, went to church today. I actually, you know, put a little bit of lipstick on. I, I did not do a full face of lipstick. I, um, anyway, that's a whole other story. But, uh, or a full face of makeup. But um, that says a lot because if you remember, I said at day one, the beginning of week one, I just had no energy. I had no motivation. Like I just did not really uh, care about leaving my house or even trying to um, look cute or look like any human being. And uh, today I threw on some heels and I threw on some lipstick and... Um, I got out and all day I've had energy. I've not had that feeling of exhaustion or fatigue. As a matter of fact, I went out um, around the city for a little bit. So today I was, I was active today. So I am feeling good. Um, I'll be totally honest. I am the, the I, like I said, the food prep side of it. And this is just me personally. This is nothing to do with the program in and of itself. The supplements, I am having no problems with them. Um, I am getting them down when I'm supposed to. Um, like I said, I think, oh, what is this? Today is day seven. So maybe around day four-ish, I had a little bit of nausea, can't figure out why or what that was about because I don't think I did anything differently. Um, I've really been taking the supplements on an empty stomach prior to breakfast or either or prior to a meal. Um, and I thought that would cause some nausea, but it didn't, it hasn't. And around day four, when I had the nausea, all I remember is I took it when I ate. So really weird so i went back to taking it on an empty stomach which is total opposite for me but it works um and i only had it that one day so i don't know it might have been just a fluke or something else but other than that the supplements i'm getting them down without any thought if you remember my first video it was just a conundrum with me trying to get those pills down and now it's just like boop swallow boop swallow boop swallow done bodied it so um the supplements cool no problem um uh, like i said the meal prep i the meal prep is fun i've been doing a little vlogging my videos and that's fun um unless i have something to do and then i feel like it's time consuming i'm still trying to get used to that five meals a day and granted it's not huge meals it's breakfast and an after breakfast snack lunch after lunch snack and dinner they're not huge in a sense, in essence, but literally for me, I feel like I am eating and waiting to eat again. I mean, you're talking about someone who really had bad eating habits and maybe woke up and didn't do breakfast and probably didn't do lunch and then did a late dinner and a big dinner. And I'm sure that's where a lot of my weight gain came from and all these other things, but I was eating maybe once once and a half twice a day and now i'm having to eat five times a day like who does that you savages who eats that much but <laughs> but um i get it it kicks that metabolism up and i'm putting the right things in my body so i am still working on the five meals a day but i make sure i grab some 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 nuts or um, a salad. Today I deviated a little bit from the paleo menu for the 28 day challenge that we were given. I am trying to be exceedingly strict with the meal plan, the shopping list and everything because I'm new to this and I just don't want to waver. But as I'm learning what I can and can't eat, I'm also learning to finesse those menus and do it my way and what I want. And then also because it's just me, even though it's small, a, a smaller portion for it, it's, it's a lot. It's a lot. And so I am able to sometimes what I have for dinner, I have it for lunch or like I have a fridge. This is week one. And I went grocery shopping today for week two. Big ups to me for that. 
and I still have a few leftovers and some things from this past week so I'm gonna have to get creative and utilize that stuff because I don't want to be wasting food either especially with the prices that Whole Foods has like they ain't cheap that stuff will not go to waste so um everything's all good week one is down I'm going to go and get my um 360 video I'm sure we won't see a huge, I know we won't see a huge difference, but I don't know, maybe. But um, I'm gonna go do my 360 video, which if you look in the um, Tequila Sean Health and Wellness, you'll see my vlog, my video logging and journal of the process. And I intend to do a 360 view of what my body looks like at the end of each week. And after the 12 weeks, I'm expecting amazing, mind-blowing, like, before and after so um it's nine o'clock and i haven't cooked dinner yet and like i said i'm trying to get i literally by the time it's time for one meal it's time for another and so i'm gonna get better at this and see because it's nine o'clock and i'm just doing dinner that also means i'm gonna get to bed late i gotta get better i'm gonna get better at this i'm gonna get better at this but the energy is great. I feel good. I'm looking good. I could see my skin just, like I said, acne or anything like that was never a problem with my skin, but I just felt like it was dull. I'm used to having a glow and just my eyes being lit up. And um, so I'm, I'm, I'm seeing a little bit of she coming back in there. So anyway, the end of week one, day seven is done. I'll see y'all tomorrow in week number two. Good night.